It's incredible when Yaakov Inu came down to Mitzrayim and he saw Yosef, he said Shema. You know what's incredible? When we say Shema, we close our eyes. We don't want that Re'iyah. We want a Re'iyah of Eidus, of Torah. And that's why there's two big letters in the Pasuk Shema Yisrael. There's the big Ayin of Shema and there's the big Dalet of Echad. Those two letters in the Sefer Torah are written grand or big ones. Ayin from Shema and Dalet from Echad. Ayin Dalet is aid. When you close your eyes, when you take your eyes away from Taiva Hilei Naim, when you close yourself off from seeing Taiva Hilei Naim, then you become an aid, then you become a witness who has a real Re'iyah that can testify a Torah Re'iyah. When you Yaakov came down and he saw Yosef's greatness. He realized Yosef's Shmir Sinayim brought him to the level of being an aid, of seeing Torah, of seeing Elikus in the world. And that's why he recited Shema. He realized that Yosef was living a life of Shema with his eyes closed from anything enticing. And he was living the life of an aid. That's Avoid of Rosh Hashanah. That's Avoid of El. That's the Pshat Re'e Yonoichi. The first Rosh Chodesh, the first week of El, the first day of El. Re'ei, we've got to restore the Re'iyah. Onoichi, says the Balaturim, is Onoichi Hashem Le'kecho, connects us to Matan Torah, to Onoichi Hashem Le'kecho. Re'ei, Onoichi, the Pesach is saying, see the Onoichi, see, restore your eyes back to the eyes of Atah Horei Saladas, of Matan Torah. And then, Re'ei Onoichi, and then, Noisin Lefneichem Ayoyim Brocho Klala. Then you see so clearly, then the Das, the Toiv and Ra are not mixed together. Es HaBrocha Shetishmon, Es HaKlala Em Loitishmon, you see clearly what's bracha, what's kalala. You see everything so clearly. That's the parish of Re. That's how we begin El. Mekabal upon ourselves to shmir sinayim. Mekabal upon ourselves to see everything, to gaze properly, to have a, the proper outlook of Torah mitzvahs, and to see everything with a re'ir, with a far-sighted re'ir. That's why the end of Re'e is talking about Oil Asriya coming to the Besamikdash to restore our eyesight. The Besamikdash was generally speaking a place for kapara, to atone for sins, to bring a korban to atone for sins. And therefore, the mitzvah to come on Yom Tev to the Beis Hamikdash was Yeroi Kol Zechucho Kederek Shabal Liroi says the Gemara Kachbal Liroi to come and see Hashem, to come and see the Re'e. That's the beginning of Re'e and the end of Re'e, the climax. Of Yom and Neiroim is Chag Hasukois, which is Man Simchoseinu. What brings Simcha? Clarity brings Simcha. Clarity brings Simcha. Ein Simcha Kataras Asveikas Sechazal. There's no Simcha that, when, 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 when there's no Simcha like the Simcha that takes away doubt when everything is clear. Zman Simchoseinu is when we have a proper Re'iya, when we see things clearly. That's Sukkah, Zman Simchoseinu. The word Sukkah means Soicha, to gaze, to gaze. The first Gemara, the first Mishnah in Sukkah is Sukkah where the Schach is Lamalam Yesrim Amma, above Esrim Amma is Psula. Says the Gemara, do you know why Schach, which is higher than 20 Amas, is possible? Lefishloi Sholta Ba'eno. Because the eye can't see the schach. Loi shalta ba'eno, a deeper meaning means that the eye is not in control. The eye is not shoylet. The eye has to be shoylet. We have to have a re'i of kedusha. You have to be able to see the schach. You have to be able to see the tzil on the meimenusa. And when you see the schach, when you're soiche, when you see the real re'i, then it's zman simchaseinu. Yosef at tzadik, he's the simcha. The Gemara says that ain. Ben da ein ein zara shall Esav noifel eli bidi zara shall Yosef. Zara shall Esav are going to fall to zara shall Yosef. Esav is Amalek. Amalek is gematria sophic. He takes away our ear. He takes away our clarity. We don't see things properly when Amalek's around. Yosef at Tzadik sees things properly. So Yosef, Mashiach ben Yosef, he's the one that's going to destroy Amalek. He's the one that's going to destroy. Mashiach, uh, um, um, Amalek. So Mamela Sukkah is as man of Simchaseinu because that's where we connect to the Re'i of Kedusha. Shem should help us that we should be Zoycha to a Re'i of Kedusha. We should be Zoycha to be Edim with our Enayim to test, give testimony that HaKadosh Baruch Hu is the boy Re'olam and to see the dark Hashem and to see how everything is Latoiva and to see the master plan and the idea of Akarish Baruchu, Metzashem Bakarev, Bimher of Yamena, and the Wish Bizarcha, the Sachazeno, a Nainu Meshuv Cholatzian, the A Nainu Serena Malchusacha, Bimher of Yamena. Thank you for listening to the Gargirai's daily Chizuk broadcast. Pass them on to your friends and help spread Kedusha in the world.